Previously, paranoia infected the house. He's gonna be after me now. I have a feeling he's gonna be I'm paranoid. <laughs> Dina Wolf for us too. Huh? He hates everyone. She's on the warpath. I know Caroline had, had it in for me. I've turned in stupid. Every week, the person who Caroline doesn't like seems to go up. I'm so sorry. Two faced. Oh, boo woo. I know she's been talking shit about me. I don't care anymore. I didn't realise people hate me that much. This is what hell must be like. Tonight, it's time for a fresh start. It'll get better if we try and talk. You don't like me. Any problems, please tell me. Yeah, yeah. I do genuinely want to be a friend. I'm mad at him. Yeah, a little bit bad. The thing we can do to improve our relationship is to stop saying anything behind each other's back. Mm -hmm. You need to know that we can trust you. You should know that already. Really, really, really hard to be a nice person in this house. I thought what you did to was absolutely, like, disgusting. I think it's ridiculous. How did you be really angry? She's fake. One time! I want that t-shirt. Oh, uh, I just had enough. I really am stuck anywhere in what I'm doing. Dear 43, 9.32 a.m. After weeks of infighting, last night's Fierce to Fierce nominations brought tensions into the open. Uh, my first nomination is Lauren. It's Lauren. And I just thought it was very sneaky. It went behind my back. Lauren, Lauren, a nightmare. Sometimes I don't know if you are going behind my back or not. Lauren. I find it a bit sneaky and snidey. Uh, my second nomination is Luke A. Luke. For some reason, you, you got some hatred towards me. Luke A. Sometimes you just make me feel that you don't like me. I'm scared of walking out the door and getting booed. <sighs> and a rule break rocked Adam and Dina. Oh, next week is going to be me. Week after that, piano. Just... At 11:16 p.m., <sighs> Dina <me>. and Luke <laughs> A. had the following conversation. <laughs> I know next week it's going to be me. Week after that, it's going to be Adam. You just said my name. I heard your name. Yeah, my name, um, it's an idea in our head, but you just put it in somebody else's head. Mm. Yeah, there's no way I, I get to look next year. She was saying different shit about different Lauren people. and Adam and stuff like that, yeah. yeah. Big Brother has called Luke A yeah. to yeah. the diary room. Cup of coffee? Oh. Good, you feeling better? Yeah. Good. Right. Oh. How's it going on for a while? Big argument? Um, I think so, yeah. Can you talk, Big Brother, through exactly how you're feeling this morning? Uh, isolated, hated, um, judged. Who do you feel hates you? <sighs> Apart from Adam, possibly Dina, and Lauren, I think everybody. Why exactly do you think they hate you? Because I'm different to them. Because I don't conform to their group. I don't suck their asses because I don't tell them they're great every day. I don't let them get away with apologising to me and then doing exactly the same thing the next day. I haven't f felt like I've fitted in properly since day one, really. Um, I got that feeling from Lucas first. And, like he was sort of looking down his nose at me. And Becky's hurts me, but she is an actress. And she's fake. But at this present in time, she's hot stuff in the house. She's been saved. Her and Connor have, on the surface, made up. She's sort of taking Trevon's role. At the moment, she's untouchable. That's why she feels she can go around the house screaming and sort of intimidating us and being nasty to us, because she doesn't need us anymore to fall back on. 
Yeah. Right, Carol, please come down and tell me what happened. Why is no one telling me? This is the biggest gossip I've heard in all, all year. Right, so, basically, we were all led in bed and then what happened? Yeah. Adam slept in his original bed. Wow, what, what were they on about? You obviously heard the conversation. Dean had obviously mentioned Adam's name. Which I can understand is annoying, but he, I, think he, I think he's blown out of proportion. He is a grown man, so why the fuck is he doing that to a 23 year old girl moving beds when yeah, all she said is her I name? Their plan's working there over the moon, and we're devastated because whatever happens, one of us is gone. How would you like the house to be? <laughs> Understanding, unified, happy, having fun, enjoying the most of the summer, pulling together in teamwork and tasks. Well, I can try talking to them and hopefully we can start understanding. It might be a bit like the vampires and the werewolves in Twilight where you get that barrier thing, but I'm sure um, it'll get better if we try and talk. But I just think I just think it's ridiculous. Like I just I just think it's absolutely ridiculous. I don't understand it and I think it's ridiculous. Dina said she's talked to you and sort of day with you. Yeah, I want to talk to her again today because yeah, like, it is it's ridiculous. Yeah. She didn't mean any harm by anything. I know, I know. And, and, and I it's... don't know why Adam's moved bed. Like I'll say this to him as well, like it's yeah. ridiculous. It's absolutely ridiculous. Pathetic. Like I just Maybe think... you should speak to him. I will speak to him, but he's sleeping. I'm not gonna wake him up to this. Luke. Uh, five minutes. Sorry. <sighs> Just uh, die rooms put shit into perspective and all that bollocks, you know. I'm gonna be 100% honest with you, right? And this is hard. But like, I don't know what it is, but from day one, I felt like you don't like me. And I'm, I don't know if I'm wrong or right, and I felt like I didn't know what I did. No, I do. But I don't know. When I slept in the room, I'm like, Luke doesn't like me for some reason. Really? Yeah. I'm exactly the same. But then, like, but then I chat to you, and then the chat's all right, and I'm like... Yeah. I'm really confused. I, yeah, so I'm like, does he like me or not? It's this place, when it parano makes you paranoid... Yeah, it really does. And I'm like... He's being sarcastic, I'm like... Which bit was it? How sarcastic? Stupid thing, like, when I said, are you hungry? And you were like, yeah, but you didn't look at me and just walked straight on. I thought that was sarcastic. No. Well, I'm, I'm very angry, so I want to speak to him. Why are you angry? Because I don't think it's fair what they've done to you. And you were upset last night and they didn't speak to you. No, no, but, but listen, it's my fault because I broke Dina, the rules. Dina, it's not your fault. So what? Everybody breaks the rules. It's not, not your fault. Not as many times as me. Dina, everybody has mentioned people's names. It's not your fault. I don't think it's fair and I feel very strongly about this and I don't like when people come in and talk about it. They should have come to you, it's not fair. They say that they're grown men and they've come in, they've come in. Mm. They've not spoken to you about it. They've yeah. spoken to everybody else about it. I don't think that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not having it. Yeah, you yeah, and you should have spoken to me. You and yeah. I can sort your difference out. I just want to speak to him first and just, yeah. ex and just explain to him that I don't think it was nice what he did. You know what the thing is, I'm just upset with myself. But that's ridiculous. Honestly, you think I am? You're being really? ridiculous, yes. You're being absolutely ridiculous. If I was you, I'd be really angry. Mm. They're supposed to be your friends and they can turn on you like that. Yeah. People say things like, you didn't mean anything bad by it. Yeah. I feel like I'm, I'm invisible in the house, yeah. you know? And, like, even from when you came down the stairs, you seemed so cool and you didn't really speak to me for two weeks and that's probably my fault too. Yeah. You know? But I, I was quite intimidated by you. Yeah. Not because you're a nasty person, but yeah. because you're such, sort of, like, a level-headed cool guy yeah. with an amazing body, do you know what I mean? <laughs> That's what I thought, because when... I know, obviously, when you told me about your past, and then you were like, you were the one that I was yeah. a bit scared about telling the most, and I was yeah. like, oh, don't be. Yeah. Like, I find that absolutely fascinating. But then, it's because, like, you've got your closer friends, yeah. And I've got my closer friends, and that's what will divide people in the house in I terms hate, of hate daily conversation. Yeah. Do you but know what I mean? I'm not influenced about shit like that. Like, in this house, I don't hate anybody. I never yeah. have hated anybody. This, this chat isn't about that, because I fully understand. Yeah. I fully understand. And, like, I can be sarcastic sometimes, like with yeah. Caroline. I'm sure there's things I, that annoy people about me, but I I'd like wish... to think it's not outweighed by, obviously, my nicer side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As, but... as anyone else in this house. Yeah, we're probably both to both to blame in terms of <laughs> I don't... conversing and stuff. Yeah, so... 
<laughs> it's fine. Sorry, man. Yeah. Sorry. Okay. It's fine. And if you ever do have a problem with me, just pull you to one side. It. Yeah. Just fucking talk to me. Just pull you to one side and say it. Ooh. That's cool. But yeah. Thanks for listening to me anyway. Like. Yeah. I don't know. Really. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Cheers. <sighs> I need to speak to Caroline tonight as well, man.